Okay, we're on program eight now. Yep. Okay, let me just write down. Where's my pen? Oh, that's apt. Ha <laughs> ha, very funny. Do not steal. You seen it, Justin? Yeah, thought not. Cameraman, Cliff, you had me pen? Nah, thought not. <laughs> Can't leave nothing round here. Ready? Okay, yep. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> call your home I don't know where you eat your meals or where you talk on the phone I don't know if you got a cook a butler or a maid I don't know if you got a yard with a hammock in the shade I don't know if you got some shelter say a place to hide I don't know if you live with friends in whom you can't confide I don't know if you got a family, say your mom or dad. I don't know if you feel love at all, but I bet you wish you had. Come and go with me to my father's house. Come and go with me to my father's house. It's a big, big house with lots and lots of room. A big, big table with lots and lots of food. A big, big yard where we can play football. A big, big house. It's my father's house. All I know is a big old house with rooms for everyone. All I know is lots of land where we can play and run. All I know is you need love and I've got a family. All I know is you're all alone, so why not come with me? I'll come and go with me to my father's house. Come and go with me to my father's house. It's a big, big house with lots and lots of room. A big, big table with lots and lots of food. A big, big yard where we can play football. A big, big house. It's my father's house. A big, big house with lots and lots of room. A big, big table with lots and lots of food. A big, big yard where we can play football. A big, big house. It's my father's house. It's my father's house. Come and go with me to my father's house. Come and go with me to my father's house. It's a big, big house with lots and lots of room. A big, big table with lots and lots of food. A big, big yard where we can play football. A big, big house. It's my father's house. A big, big house with lots and lots of room. A big, big table with lots and lots of food. A big, big yard where we can play football. A big, big house. It's my father's house. Going extra mile to bring you a smile, smile, smile. And here we are together with the smile phrase. Hey up, my name's AJ and I'm here to do smile mega phrase. And these are reinforced because this series is based on Ten Commandments. These rules were given to Moses by God. They are rules so we can walk the right path with Jesus. They are not there to spoil our fun, they are there to protect us. Remember, wear a smile, one size fits all. What we're going to do is go through these mega phrases and we're going to go through them a couple of times so we can remember them. Are we ready children? Here we go. It's smile phrase number eight. 
do not steal. And that's in the Old Testament in the book of Exodus. And that is chapter 20, verse 15. Children, can you say it with me? Do not steal. Exodus 20, verse 15. Right, over to Justin with news. Justin. This is Justin with the news. Justin. Thieving, robbing, stealing, nicking are just some of the words used on the streets at the moment for breaking of the commandment number seven. There are increased incidents of people taking things which don't belong to them. It happened to me just the other day. I left my pen on the side and when I looked again it had gone. Miraculously, no one knew where it was. Oh, that was just a report in. From me. Just in. Another incident happening in someone else's home. Yes, a break-in, but there is good news to end this story when a parrot intervened. Alright, that should do it. I have to go next door for a minute to see Miss Guy. So Cyril, I need you and Paris to keep an eye on the house. Right, be a good dog, Paris. I'll be right back. Okay, coast is clear. What are you doing? You heard, Danny. I'm on guard detail. Yes, but is all that marching really necessary? I suppose you're right. <gasps> And I'm kind of tired. I can't go and lie down for a while. You do that. I'll use the code phrase if anything ever happens. <gasps> okay. Cool. Danny just left and nobody else is around. I can take all the sweets I want and no one will ever know. Okay, let's see. Lollipops? Nah. Chocolate? Nope. Ooh la la la, I'll take a couple of those. Haha, <laughs> the good old five finger, um, okay, four finger discount. Jesus is watching you. Ah! Jesus is watching you. <laughs> what? Who said that? Come out where I can seize you. I must be hearing things. What else can I grab before Danny gets back? Crunch bar? Don't think so. Yummy bar? Not. Hey, chocolate sticks, cool. Oh, it's just a stupid bird. Do me a favour and keep your big beak shut, okay? What else? Chews? Nuh uh. Jellies? No. Ah, pick and mix, my favourite. Juice is watching you. Ah! Juice is watching you. I've had just about enough for you. What is your name anyway? Moses. Moses? What kind of idiot names this bird Moses? The same idiot who named this god dog Jesus. <laughs> N nice doggy. Uh, hey, hey, get off me! Get off me! Hey, get out! Get out! Uh, get away! My goodness! What was that all about? Jesus is watching you. Jesus is watching you. Now, where did you learn that? It's true enough, though. No matter where we go or what we do, Jesus is always watching us. Please, please, Danny, stop, call your dog off. Down, boy! What's this all about? I don't know. I was just walking by your house when all of a sudden your crazy dog started barking and chasing me. Okay, okay, I, I took some sweets. I saw you pop next door and leave the door open. I just couldn't resist. Now, will you call your dog off, please? Why'd you do it, Vinny? You were next door. Nobody else was in the house. When I come around with my dad, I know you always have sweets in here. Well, I, I didn't figure anybody would be around to see me. Jesus is watching you. Ah! Jesus is watching you. <whistles> you know, Cyril here is right. Cyril? He told me his name was Moses. Well, that's impossible. He's just a parrot. He only repeats 
what he hears from others, he can't really talk. But, but, but... He, he's right enough. Even when no one else is looking, Jesus sees everything we do. So, there's really no such thing as not getting caught. That's right. God says we shouldn't steal, and he always knows if we have, even if nobody else does. I'm sorry, Danny. From now on, I'll buy my sweets from the shop. Finney, how would you like to earn some extra money? Earn extra money? How? Well, I've been looking for someone to take Paris for a walk. You know, somebody to come in a few days each week, spend some time with him, an hour or so after school. Are you interested? Sure, but you'd really be interested in hiring me after I tried to steal from you. You'll have to w work hard and earn my trust, but I figure everybody deserves a second chance. Wow, that would be terrific. Um, but I'd have to ask my parents first, though. Of course. You just stop by tomorrow afternoon and let me know what, what they say. You got it. Thanks, Danny. Finny, you're welcome. That's a good boy. <laughs> Sometimes I think you know more than you let on. Right. Well, I have to finish my business next door. Be right back. Sometimes I think you know more than you let on, indeed. We well, do we really have to keep pretending? I think it's best. People don't handle it very well when they find out we can really talk. What was that all about with Finney? Kids are different. They tend to handle it better. Besides, I already broke the rule with him. I think it'll be good to have Vinny around. We'll see, Paris. We'll see. <gasps> Back to that nap. Wait, if I need to chase anyone again? God, dog, indeed. <laughs> have a bit of smile. Yep, yeah, I know the weather's bad, but just get a smile in. Yeah, look into the camera, Heather. I oh, wish she got. Yeah, there she is. Right, ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Hello, Heather here with the weather. Well, yesterday I wondered where the sun had gone, but it came to me in a flash. It was night time. <laughs> Silly me. Anyway, Today, we are having no sun again. Not because it's night time, but because my friend, Oliver Overcast, tells me it's just a dull day. However, don't let this get you down. Cheese up up and wear something bright, like me. Hope that helps. Lovely. That was the weather for you today. From me, Heather. Remember, God created the Okay, welcome to this production meeting for our next set of program. Okay, what we need to make sure, Katrina, is we get good shots on them faces as them puppeteers are dancing, okay? Carl, what I want you to do, mate, is make sure all them cables are out of the way. We want it nice and tight, all right, yeah? Lenny, can you make sure that lighting is absolutely perfect? Get all them hot spots onto them puppet faces because we want it to be just right. Understand? Are we ready then, team? Let's go, all you smileys out there. Woo! Yeah. 
Clam? Clam, is that my teapot? Have you stolen my teapot? Sam! <gasps> my best china teapot! That's it, I'm calling the police! Morning has broken like the first morning! Okay, that's a wrap on programme eight. Brilliant thing was, found me pen. So, whoever nicked it, they were obviously felt guilty after that program, so it got through, did what it needed to. Excellent. Well done, kids. You did fantastic. Great. Okay. See you on program nine.